tour today. And where we are at the moment is our campsite. Uh, we call that our base, basically. We take you out from here on a couple of tours and we always come back <laughs> if you survive. get out there cruising for a couple of hours checking out the mangrove habitat in Crossel Pine River. Fish, mate? Got one. Got salmon or barra? Who's missing on the tail when we get next to the heat set? Really, he's actually named after my grandma. They don't actually look anything alike, by the way. No. See the skirt here? It's chewed off. That got chewed off by a male in breeding season a few years ago. See the little jagged tip that remains there? She's in mummy mode at the moment, Ruby. I'll show you where her nest is in a moment. It's just around the bend here. She's just tucked up there out of the breeze, side onto the sun, trying to maximise her warming rate. You can see the boyfriend's been hanging around over on the right there. Look at the size of the footprints and the slide mark over there, going up the hill. We'll just have a look around the corner and see if he's hanging about too. She's enjoying that sunshine this morning. around the 4 metre mark this guy. Have a glass of girth on him. Pretty good shape. The most important one we have here though is the secret damper recipe. So you can take one, but you're not allowed to tell anyone. It says secret up the top here. The last count, there's only 135,000 people know the secret, so we're trying to keep it pretty touch us. If you don't see that, it'd be great. But if you're not sure what damper is, you will find out about that a little later. And 
what we've whipped up a couple of dampers in some cast iron pots called camp ovens. And you wouldn't want to be carrying one of these on your back out in the middle of nowhere, they weigh about 10 kilos. Give you a bit of a workout, but uh, the damper was a, uh, an original basic bush bread that they'd make. They'd be carrying plain flour, a bit of salt. Uh, when they camp at night, they'd actually build a fire. If they had meat to cook, they'd probably throw that on first. And then uh, while they were waiting for the meat to cook, they'd actually mix up a sticky water dough with some prep water and uh, a little bit of salt thrown in. And then before that dough went on to cook, they'd actually break the fire apart, so they'd dampen the fire down. A bit like a damper in a fireplace from coal companies where they open and close the plate to increase or decrease the airflow. So the damper itself also, the dough had a dampening effect as they rolled around in the coal too, to cool it even further. So we uh, boiled our billiard today on a bit of iron bark there. I've just popped some leaves on top here before. Can you see them floating on the top? Well, we usually run out of leaves and we use a cow pack. So guess what it is, all right? Yeah. So, when you're going to use a, a lid today, you can use a stick or rock, but just tapping the tin 